What I want to talk today about is an initiative that's been put together uh, by the industry to address some of the structural technology issues that the industry is facing um, called Marco Polo. Uh, Marco Polo is a consortium of leading financial institutions um, as well as technology providers and soon to be logistics providers, ERP providers and others within the ecosystem that are developing, uh, co-developing two things. One is an open and global platform for trade and trade finance, similar to in the way that iOS and Android provide a common operating system that allows an ecosystem of very connected value added services, financial institutions, as well as banks, buyers, suppliers, to connect and exchange data and value, as well as the open technology standards that allow both new and existing technology systems to connect, creating a global network of networks similar to how the internet works. In fact, us in the financial institutions like to say, Marco Polo is doing for trade what the internet did for information. Um, and this is the mandate that we received from the founding financial institutions, which is we want to better serve our customers, many of them here in this room, by converging both physical, informational, and financial data, um, using that data to provide pre, post, inventory, uh, all manner of different trade and working capital solutions to their clients with easier access to secure and verified data on a global digital platform. And um, so that's what we, in partnership with several other technology providers, us being the main ones developing it, um, have brought to the industry and are currently working not just with financial institutions, but with many large corporates and, and logistics providers, trade credit insurers, ERP providers, on providing an end-to-end -end platform where we have applications, an operating system, an entire rules engine for managing all the different interactions on the platform, all running on a core open and standard technology infrastructure, which we call the Universal Trade Network, um, with in cooperation with standards bodies like ICC and industry utilities like SWIFT, as well as the ecosystem of trading parties, banks, buyers, suppliers, logistics providers, creating the open technology standards similar to TCP IP and HTTP, which enabled a truly interoperable network of networks that allowed the real-time exchange of information for applying those same principles to trade data and trade assets. And so if you're interested in learning more about uh, how this consortium could potentially help you or your institution or your organization, uh, we'd love to talk. All right.